If you want to learn how to record your security camera on the internet, just keep watching. Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Claudemir Martins, and today I will talk about security cameras cloud recording. So just imagine a situation where you need to record locally. You have your cameras recording on the DVR, but you want to record also on the internet. So you have a backup. Let's see how it works. Here in my computer, I have a diagram. So basically I have an analog camera. The analog camera can send the signal to a DVR, and then the DVR can record locally. I have my local recording just right here. And then I have the internet and my router. So I can connect my DVR to the router and from the router, I connect to the internet. Somewhere on the internet, I have a server and I can connect to the server. And then I have my cloud recording, meaning I'm recording remotely. So basically I have local recording here with high quality. And then I have a connection to the internet. Then I, I don't have bandwidth enough in most of the case. Then I need to record here with low quality. So basically high quality here and recording with low quality here because I don't have bandwidth enough. Of course, you can buy more bandwidth if you want to. You, you can pay more for bandwidth. Then you can record like with high quality in both sides. But most of the cases, you, you record with low quality on the internet and high quality locally, okay? Back here to the diagram, if you want to have local access to your system, you just need to have a computer. So in this computer, I'm going to install a software. And with this software, I can see the image from the camera live. And also can see the image that are recorded here on my DVR. The same way I can see what's recorded here on my remote servers, remote server on the internet. And let's see this situation right now if I have a switch connected to my system. I don't know if you have like knowledge on networks, but switch is basically a box with a lot of ports, physical ports. You can connect everything there on your network. You can connect your computer, your laptop, your router, your DVR, your IP camera. Basically, you connect everything to the switch. So back here to the diagram, we see the switch just right here, connecting the DVR, connecting the, my computer and the router. I can connect more computers here to have access to my network. So basically, it's the same principle. Now I have my computer that's able to uh, grab video from the camera or for, from the DVR and also is able to, to see videos coming from the remote server. Here another situation where I have IP camera connected directly to a router. So I don't have a recorder here. I could have a recorder, I could, could have an NVR. An NVR, NVR is a network video recorder. It's just a little bit, bit different from the DVR. DVR is digital video recorder and NVR is network video recorder because the camera, IP camera already sends the video in digital format. So I don't need to convert on the recorder. I just send directly from the camera to record on the network video recorder or I can use a SD card on the camera and record directly from the camera. So here it's what I have. I have IP camera here with a card, SD card inside. It's recording directly here in the camera. And then I can send this video through the internet and record here on my remote server. And also I can, of course, see the videos locally here from the camera live or from my SD card that's already here installed in the camera. And I can see what's recorded here on my remote server. Here's the same situation now with the IP camera using a switch and the router and here's my remote server. Same way you can have access to everything here locally or remotely. So it's basically pretty simple. You just need to have your device record locally to record locally and also you can have a recorder remotely. You just need to buy a service. You call somebody and then you buy like a clouding service recorder and then you can record there and you can have access there. Doesn't matter if you are at home, if you are at office or a hotel, you can have access directly to your cloud service, okay? So that's all for today. 
Thank you for watching this video. If you want to learn more, just subscribe to the channel. You can also download the free guide. You just need to, uh, to click in the description and download your free guide. And don't forget to hit the thumbs up and leave your comments. So see you in the next video.